Hello everyone and welcome to Racing Games Show, my name is Wojtek and today I just wanted to give you a quick update about DTM experience as the multiplayer uh, in alpha stage was released just today or just sorry just yesterday actually and so I just wanted to bring you some footage and just give you some opinions, my first impressions and thoughts about the multiplayer that is available now at DTM experience. So as you could have seen there, uh, collisions are off inside the pit lane. That wouldn't be a big issue, same as in iRacing. Uh, that's not something I would be worrying about. Uh, actually, it's actually a good thing in my opinion. Uh, now, uh, the only servers are available at the moment are all in Europe. Uh, I suppose they are hosted by the developer. So you American guys, uh, I suppose there, there would be still pretty good pings from America, but most of the guys at the server I was running, uh, we are in the qualifying session at the moment, was from Europe, you will be able to see the pings uh, I was getting uh, and other players were getting just later in this video, because I had to switch some of the options, I normally like to have my hood turned off. Yeah, I put it back on for this video. Now, as you can clearly see, uh, netcode is quite good. Cars moving around really, really smooth. You could just see a second ago if someone would be trolling or reversing along the track, he would be ghosted. He wouldn't collide with that kind of guy, which is really, really big plus. Because uh, all kind of driving the wrong way. Slowing down on brake checking, well, maybe not brake checking, but yeah, slowing awfully, s dr driving awfully slow would be eliminated. And here again, you could see the guy that was coming back onto the track after the speed was also turned off. Now, and here you might have some worries, right? But do not worry because this guy had a pink in about seven, six hundreds. And yeah, I'm really happy I could take a look how this works if someone has an acceptable ping. Yeah, you can see this guy here again. It's flying a little bit on the track, but the good thing is actually disappearing when it's really really bad. So it's similar in a racing fashion again. It's, I really would like to prefer guys to disappear and appear in the track rather than fly all the way around and causing uh, impossible crashes. Ah, that's the rookie of the start. Actually, so sorry, it's not rookie, it's just uh, life as I was racing. And again, it's looking pretty, pretty good. Even this guy is the guy with 200 pink. He actually spun out there. It worked really, really well. Like there, there's no real lags. Everything is working really, really smooth. So yeah, despite it's been in alpha stage, it's I, I, I could call it really down, in my opinion. Maybe they need to work on some details I wouldn't be aware of, but yeah, for me it works very nice. As you can see, players receiving stop and go penalties. That's just a bump from behind. I get a truck cutting warning. Yeah, but it, it works really, really well. The chat is working very nice. As you can see it now, you can call someone an idiot if you want. And another quite important thing, uh, whenever player connects or disconnects from the server, there is no any kind of lag, no any kind of uh, freezing or anything like that that would happen in other games. So it's another plus. Like I said, uh, it's really really great experience to drive multiplayer at this stage as it is now. And they, they apparently they're gonna try to make it even better. So I'm really happy about that. 
players cannot create servers yet. Uh, I tried, apparently, I'm not too sure, but it looks like it's not that option is not available yet. And there would be about uh, 20 servers hosted at the moment, and I would say they're hosted by the developers even. And yeah, that's about it. So I must say, yeah, this is very nice close racing here. I must say, this game for this price, it's really a steal at the moment. It's very nicely done, complete game, very good license. And for 12 or 50 cents on Steam at the moment in summer sale. If you don't have it, you should really get it. Because this game now is a complete package with multiplayer, a nice on a nice career a single player. DTM is a very nice license, all the tracks are here. And yeah, and it's all could only get better at this stage. So that's about it in this video. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, please leave a comment. You might subscribe if you enjoy my videos. And I see you guys around. Take care.